Hello, I am Shay and welcome to my cave. So today I'm going to be telling you guys about the rest of the books that I bought in February. Um, I did a mid-February haul where I bought something like 18 books. I think it was 18. I have 8 this time to show you guys, so this one will be somewhat shorter. So first up I want to show you 3 books. Um, they're actually a trilogy, a completed trilogy that I got. And they are the Across the Universe trilogy? Is that what they're called? Now, I, now I'm not sure. Oh yeah! Book two in the Across the Universe trilogy. So these are by Beth Revis. I have Across the Universe, book one. Book two is A Million Suns. And book three with the random cover change is Shades of Earth. I love the first two covers. I'm not as big of a fan. I mean, I like the third cover, but I think I like the other one better. Um, and it would have been nice if I would have at least gotten the first two in the covers to match this one. But that wasn't the case, but that's okay. Whatever. Whatever. So these are sci-fi-ish books about a girl, Amy, who is cryogenically frozen and put on board of a spaceship so that she can go join her parents in their spaceship and all that good stuff. I don't know much else about it, but I'm sure something probably goes wrong and that's probably what these books are all about. So these are the first three books. There you go. The next book that I got um, I'm kind of excited about because this is another kind of Alice in Wonderland retelling kind of thing. Um, it's called Insanity and it's by Cameron Jace. And this actually I think might be like a self-published author, um, but he actually wrote the Grimm Diaries prequels, I think is what they're called. It was like a series of short stories and they're basically like the all the Grimm, Brothers Grimm fairy tales, and they're really cool, and it was like all the different fairy tales kind of interwove themselves together, and there were characters from different stories meeting each other. But anyway, this one is about a girl um, who killed people, and so now she's at an asylum. <sighs> That's all I really know about this one too, so I don't really know how this one will play into the whole Alice in Wonderland thing other than the girl's name is Alice. Um, but yeah, so, and the cover's really cool, I love the cover. Um, it was really well done. So, I don't know when I'll read this one, but I'm excited to, as I always am. Otherwise, I probably wouldn't have bought the book if I didn't want to read it, so there's that. So the next book that I got is Alienated by Melissa Landers, and this one is about um, our world, and there is a foreign exchange student program, but it's actually intergalactic space alien style, where a human goes up to a different planet, and an alien comes down onto our planet. And I'm guessing this is about all about the family or the whatever, the girl that hosts the alien. Or maybe it's the girl that goes to the alien planet. I don't know. This one looks really interesting. Um, Sasha over on A Book Utopia seems to really love it. So I thought that I would give it a try. Um, the second one is out. I think it came out somewhat recently. It's called Invaded. So yeah, this one is cool and stuff. The next one is actually an oldie but a goodie. At least I think it's, I mean, I don't know actually if it's good because I haven't read it. It's Shiver by Maggie Stiefvater and it's the first book in the Shiver trilogy or the Wolves of Mystic Falls. Oh man, I'm not doing good with this one. Is it Mystic Falls from Vampire Diaries? I don't know. Anyway, so this is the first book in that trilogy. Um, I have heard all about that trilogy and I've heard mixed things about it. Some people do like it, some people don't like it. So I am excited to read it and form my own opinion on it. It's about wolves, like, I think werewolves and stuff, so that's cool. This will be something different, and the cover is very cool. I love the tree and the white and the blue, and the second and third one I think are like green and red or something. But yeah, so there's this one. Alright, the next one I have is Second Chance Summer by Morgan Matson. I just recently got um, Amy and Roger's Epic Detour by her. Um, and this one looks really interesting. It looks like just a really good like contemporary novel about summer, about a girl during summer. Um, so actually I would probably read this during the summer because I was like reading books that take place during the same season, I guess, that I'm in or something. So yeah, that's this one, Second Chance Summer. And then the final book on my haul for this month is Aquifer. Aqu I think that's how you say it by Jonathan Friesen. Friesen? Fr there are so many hard words to say on this book cover. But this one is a dystopian book where water, like clean water, has become very scarce. And it is the main character's 
like family's job to go and get clean water from this place and it's like this treacherous journey kind of thing and so now the main character um, has to do that and I think that's what this whole book is about. It's a really odd size, it's like shorter than like a regular size book which is kind of frustrating because I'm one of those people that likes all my books to be like the same size. Um, but this one looked really interesting. I actually got this one off of Book Outlet and it just looked really interesting. I think it was during a sale, um, so I got it pretty cheap. And so yeah, I haven't actually ever heard anything about this book from anybody. Not on booktube, not, I, I just, yeah. So this one, I don't know when I'm gonna get to it. It's pretty short, so maybe I'll like tack it onto the end of one of my month's TBR piles just to get another book in there. These are all the books that I got for the second half of this month. Um, I think I did a pretty good job. Um, yeah, so now I'm going to put them all away. So I hope you all have a great night and I will see you next time. Bye! Who is cryogen... Gen... 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 That could be bad. Lucy, go lay down. Go. Go, 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 go. Child of the night. Alienated by Melissa Anders. No, there's an L there. Alienated by Marissa Landers. Melissa. L. Melissa. I'm having so much trouble with L's right now. Interesting, I actually got this one off Book Depository. Nope, didn't. I did not get it off Book Depository.